Hi everyone, welcome to Fort Soul's Kitchen. Today, I'll be showing you how I make black eyed bean stew. It's a healthy, delicious and simple dish that's quick to put together. So if you would like to know how I made it, please keep watching. Find the complete list of ingredients needed for the recipe below. Firstly, rinse the black eye beans under running water and discard any debris and residue. Black eye beans are packed with essential nutrients high in fiber and protein, supporting heart health, digestion and weight management. They also boost your immune system and benefit your skin. Add the rinsed beans into a pot and pour in enough water to cover the beans. These beans are enjoyed globally, especially in African and Caribbean countries, because they can be used in a variety of dishes and are affordable. They are gluten-free and perfect for vegetarians and vegans. Adding them to a diet is a great choice. They are not only nutritious, but also budget-friendly. Add two bay leaves and salt to taste. Cover the pot and bring the beans to a boil. Then let them simmer for 15 minutes over medium heat or until tender. Meanwhile, I'll make the tomato stew using three large tomatoes, a bell pepper, an onion and a scotch bonnet. Give them a quick blend, just a rough blend, not too smooth. Over medium heat in a pot, I'll add palm oil and onions. Fry it until they caramelize. Then I'll add 2 tablespoons of green seasoning blend, which includes garlic, ginger, parsley and more. I'll add the blended tomato and pepper mix and saute for a minute. Then add grilled oysters, which adds a smoky aroma and punching flavor, but this is optional. I've also added a stock cube, salt and turmeric powder. Then I'll let it fry for a few minutes, stirring occasionally. Next, I'll add the tomato stews to the beans. Mix well and add smoked crayfish. Then allow it to simmer for 10 to 15 minutes. Did you know that in the southern United States, eating black eye beans on New Year's Day is believed to bring luck and prosperity for the coming year, but they can be enjoyed all year round. After a few minutes of simmering, the black eye bean stew is well cooked and ready to be enjoyed. I've served the beans with fried plantains in gari, which is a perfect combination. It can also be eaten with rice and more. This recipe is delicious and easy to make. Let me know in the comments below if you'll give this recipe a try. Thanks for watching. Please consider subscribing, like and share. Until next time, 